Do you have iron deficiency anemia? Iron deficiency anemia is a disorder in which the body's iron stores are depleted, resulting in a decrease in the amount of red blood cells. Iron is used to make red blood cells, which help the body store and transport oxygen. Your organs and tissues won't get as much oxygen as they should if you have fewer red blood cells than normal. Anemia comes in a variety of forms, each with its own set of causes. The most frequent kind is iron deficiency anemia. A lack of vitamin B12 or folate in the body can induce other types of anemia. Learn more about vitamin B12 and folate deficiency anemia. Symptoms of iron deficiency anemia? Many persons who suffer from iron deficiency anemia have only a few symptoms. The severity of the symptoms is largely determined by the rate at which anemia develops. If your anemia is caused by a long-term condition, such as a stomach ulcer, you may notice symptoms right away or over time. The most common symptoms include tiredness and lack of energy, shortness of breath, noticeable heartbeats, a pale complexion. Less common symptoms include headache, hearing sounds that come from inside the body rather than from an outside source, an altered sense of taste, feeling itchy, a sore or abnormally smooth tongue, hair loss, a desire to eat non-food items such as ice, paper or clay, difficulty swallowing, painful open sores on the corners of your mouth. What causes iron deficiency anemia? A shortage of iron in the body can be caused by a variety of factors. Bleeding in the stomach and intestines is the most prevalent cause in males and postmenopausal women. A stomach ulcer, stomach cancer, bowel cancer, or taking non-steroidal anti-inflammatory medicines can all cause this. Heavy periods in pregnancy are the most prevalent causes of iron deficiency anemia in women of reproductive age, as your body need additional iron for your baby during pregnancy. It's rare for iron deficiency anemia to be caused only by a lack of iron in your diet unless you're pregnant. If you don't get enough iron in your diet, you're more likely to get anemia than if you have one of the other disorders. How to treat iron deficiency anemia? Taking iron supplements to raise your body's low iron levels is part of the treatment for iron deficiency anemia. This is usually successful, and the condition seldom leads to long-term complications. Every few months, you'll be checked to see if the medication is working and your iron levels have returned to normal. So that you don't have anemia again, the underlying cause must be addressed. It may also be beneficial to increase the quantity of iron in your diet. If your GP believes a lack of iron in your diet is contributing to your iron deficiency anemia, he or she will advise you on how to increase your consumption. Iron-rich foods include dark green leafy vegetables, such as watercress and curly kale, iron-fortified cereals or bread, brown rice, pulses and beans, nuts and seeds, white and red meat, fish, tofu, eggs, dried fruit, such as dried apricots, prunes and raisins. To be healthy and balanced, your diet should include foods from all of the major food categories. Vitamin C rich foods and beverages are especially significant because vitamin C aids iron absorption. However, eating a lot of certain foods and drinks, as well as taking some medications, might make it difficult for your body to absorb iron. These are some of them, tea and coffee, calcium, found in dairy products, such as milk, antacids and proton pump inhibitors, medications used to relieve indigestion, whole grain cereals. Although whole grains are a good source of iron themselves, they contain phytic acid, which can stop your body absorbing iron from other foods and pills, Further problems of iron deficiency anemia. Because a lack of iron affects the body's natural defense mechanism, if iron deficiency anemia is left untreated, it might leave you more prone to illness and infection. Severe iron deficiency anemia might raise your risk of heart and lung issues, including tachycardia, which is an abnormally fast heartbeat or heart failure, when your heart is unable to pump enough blood around your body at the proper pressure. Pregnant women who have severe or untreated anemia are at a higher risk of problems during and after delivery. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video please give us a like and consider subscribing for more videos on health and well-being.